So, finally, the game has been updated. I've been waiting for this moment for a long, long time, something around 4 months, I think. And we finally got this update, which is full of features, new things and new mechanics. So, let's go on this update and see what changed. First, we have the British battlecruiser HMS Hood, which is a very, very nice ship. She has a very good survivability, very nice speed, probably the turning circle is not the best, but it's okay. Good armament, secondaries and AA guns. The secondaries have low range, but they are good anyways. She has very very nice torpedoes, even though they take a long time to reload. She gets the special German flag with less 1 seconds reload in other ship. Instead uh, you have the American which uh, goes uh, less 2 seconds instead of less 3 seconds. And so I prefer the German. And for some weird reason it gets also the Tirpitz camouflage on it. But we get it. So, we have another mechanic, which is when you keep pressing uh, on the screen, disappears everything and you can see the ship in its beauties. You can see on the shop all the specification of every ship you have, which is a, a very nice mechanic and feature. All the ship, as you can see, has been uh, replaced on the shop from the weakest to the strongest and I mostly agree with this thing with the, the ranks of the ship, I mean so they said that they have changed the damage for the torpedoes of the Yukikaze yeah, they changed it but 13,000 are not very good but anyways, it is good enough for these slow destroyers. Then they add some damage for the Melvin. It has a very good armament anyways, but now it has better armament. Then, as you can see, once a polo time, if you don't know, there was this ship called Majestic. They add something like two years ago I think and what was the worst ship of all they removed it and now they add it again she has very nice secondaries for its tier but I think in my opinion it is still the worst ship in the game but if played right I think also this ship can be very good because of its nice secondary guns and its very very rapid firing main armament so this was a ship that I like to use but yeah it's not really the best also the Sangamon change a little bit the aircraft are a little bit more powerful but the fact that is the worst aircraft carrier makes her a little bit weaker than the other and so the number of aircraft and other things doesn't make her so strong. Another thing that maybe some of you haven't noticed is that the Missouri has uh, a little bit better graphics on her hull. She has uh, these uh, little things on the hull which makes uh, a little bit better looking. Then we have some tasks which add from the number and there are also new tasks available so there are uh, more things to do if you don't know how to take monies and other things you can do them. They add some new maps, the first you have seen in the first gameplay with the hood and it's uh, uh, the uh, school. Then we have uh, this one which has a very nice graphic it is uh, also a winter map as the first one and has some cool looking ice sharps and icebergs 
on it. You can go through them and it it is um, a weird because you can pass into the ice. But it's a good looking thing and the fact that there are uh, other things instead of water that you can pass through makes this game a little bit better with this map. Then there is another map which honestly I don't really like because of the colors and uh, the position of the island but it's my, it might be a good map because there are lots and lots of islands and it's very big in my opinion and it's pretty tactical so there are lots of hiding points and um, stealth things that you can see in this map so that might be cool even though I don't really like them a lot for the last thing it changed the fire chance as you can see from this little clip I was fighting against a San Diego which after literally three shell hits he set me on fire so for this mechanic uh, I bet you not to take uh, when you get fire for the first time the uh, extinguisher because you will be set on fire again and so don't waste it the first time wait until you are in cover or the enemy doesn't fire at you so use it after it and this was everything hope you enjoyed the video and the update and i will see you on the next video bye bye